Hey guys, welcome to Over the Mooney. My name is Katie and today we have an unboxing of the best kind because we are unboxing the Wizards Vault box from the girls over at Bippity Boppity Boxes. You guys know if you've been around before that this is hands down my favorite Harry Potter box that I have experienced and I have experienced a lot and I just love this box for its customizability customization <laughs> um, they go over and above just being able to pick your house you get to pick your favorite characters you get to tell them all of the things that you like and dislike so that you can get the best box possible which is super amazing and I love it so there are two different tiers of this box that are available I will have a ton of information down in the description box below in case you are unfamiliar with this company for some strange reason <laughs> they've been around for a good deal of time now and they're amazing and I love them so much so I'm really excited to open this but I did just want to let you guys know two things before I get inside number one I am a brand rep for this box which does mean that this does get sent to me for free for review purposes for you guys but that does not mean that I am going to sugarcoat my opinions or anything I love this box period end of discussion <laughs> I love this company I love this box will forever ever ever promote them and then number two I do have a discount code to share with you guys if you are interested you can get seven dollars off of your first box of any of their boxes. It doesn't just have to be the Wizard's Vault box. It can be one of their Disney boxes. They have a ton of different fandom options to choose from. So whatever box you want to go with, you can use the promo code over the Mooney to get $7 off of your very first box. So that all being said, we're going to go ahead and get into this lovely, lovely box so excited. I have a note on top, which I haven't gotten one of these in a long time. It says a quick note about your box. This box has fewer items of higher value as opposed to more items of lesser value. We hope you love it. To change this option, please update your preference manager account. Um, I think that I have like the surprise me option because you can pick one or the other or you can pick that you would like to be surprised. And then we do have the same card as last time. It says working hard is important, but there's something that matters even more, believing in yourself, which I love. So, so very true. And then on the back here, I love that they started doing this, that you get to learn who curated your box. And this box was curated for me by Regan. So Regan, thank you so, so much. Can't wait to see what is in here. And then we have the Alhamara packing slip as well, which I am gonna put off to the side because that has everything that is inside your box, which I love because there's been times when there's so much packing confetti in here that I actually miss items. And if this packing slip wasn't here, I would probably just throw them away. So that is a plus. So this is what it looks like. I love this color, so, so pretty. So excited to see what's in here. There is a lot of packing confetti. It is flying all over the place. So I'm gonna go ahead. What is? Oh my. Oh my. <laughs> Goodness gracious. I am obsessed. 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 Okay, so it's a piece of a wearable. It's apparel. Guys, guys, are you ready? I don't know that you're ready. I'm not even ready because I haven't seen it in all its glory yet. So, okay. So it is this Hogwarts shirt. I'm going to bring you guys in because there are rhinestones and studs all over this. Oh my god. Ah! I love this! And then on the back, it says alumni. And I feel like it is not all that easy to find Hogwarts alumni stuff. And I love having Hogwarts alumni stuff because anytime that we have like a spirit, spirit day at work, which we do sometimes during our busy time to kind of like have fun at work when we're working on Saturdays. <laughs> they'll do like a week long spirit week or sometimes they'll break it out through the month and you can wear something from your alma mater. And <laughs> I don't wear anything from the real college that I went to. I either wear Monsters University spirit jersey or something from Hogwarts and I will be wearing this forever. I'm obsessed with this and I love that it's like, so it looks kind of old. 
you know, like it has like fraying. I don't know if you guys are gonna be able to see, but there's like fraying on the bottom. There's this cute little H patch, or like tag here for Hogwarts. There we go. I'm obsessed with this. <laughs> ah, oh my God, I love this so much. Regan, you got me. You, <laughs> you and me. I am obsessed. I will be wearing this forever. And it's like, it looks like a sweatshirt material, but it's not like super heavy. So this will be good for like even summer, like a cooler summer evening. I think that this would probably be good for, or even just to like wear with shorts, which I don't really wear, but <laughs> maybe one day. That's adorable and I love it. So we are, we are off to a really good start. So I'm seeing possibly just one more item in here which is completely fine they weren't kidding two items <laughs> which is fine which is perfect and this looks to be i don't know if this is bio world or lounge fly lounge fly we have a bag is that very unnerving to you when your pets just disappear <laughs> If any of you guys know where my cat went off to, let me know. <laughs> I know a lot of you watch the cat more than you watch me, which is completely fine. Oh, wow. I love this so much. This is really nice. This is really nice. So it is a crossbody bag and it looks like Harry's Quidditch uniform. So on the front, it has obviously H. Potter and some striping down here with some studs and then these stars on the back there she is all right <laughs> who do and then on the inside it has this nice zipper right here and we just have like a nice oh, I love this lining oh my gosh this lining is super pretty even this tissue paper is kind of different. I don't get a lot of lounge fly bags, but like, it's like a plaid tissue paper. All of the effort, lounge fly. Um, and then the lining is the star and stripe detailing. Obsessed. I really love this bag quite a lot. Wow. And I love that it's small. I'm really 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 a fan of this bag and will definitely use it this is more like for me a fall bag just because of the colors i am a huge huge obviously i need to extend this strap down <laughs> but yeah i love this bag oh my god this was such a great box see you don't need a thousand items in a box to make it good this was perfect with just two so i'm gonna go ahead and take a look at our spoiler shirt spoiler alert sheet. <laughs> we have our shirt, um, which is the Harry Potter crop sweater, and that is $30, which is surprising. I thought it would be a lot more considering like a spirit jersey is like 60. I for sure thought that that would be a lot more money. And then we have our Loungefly Harry Potter Tri-Wizard co Cosplay Crossbody. Aha! I was wrong. It wasn't Quidditch. It was Tri-Wizard Cup. Anyone out there correct me? Anyone out there yelling at me like, no, Katie, but it's not his Quidditch outfit because I do that to people sometimes <laughs> and then I'm like Katie you need to calm down because I just I feel like I take Harry Potter very seriously for really no reason but it's fine um, <laughs> it is the Loungefly Harry Potter Triwizard Cup cosplay crossbody for $68 for a grand total of $98 I'm a fan of this box for sure well done, Regan. Thank you so much. I really enjoyed this box. It's it's a tough choice, guys, but can you pick a favorite? I mean, I love this bag. I do. But rhinestones speak to my heart. And when I saw these rhinestones poking out, I was like, yes. Yes. This, this sweatshirt was made for me. So <sighs> I love this. I can't wait to wear this. This is so, so cute. I wish I had a trip to Universal coming up. Are any of you guys going to Universal? Have you been to Universal? What's your life like? Are you going to theme parks? Are you planning trips? Let me know. I know, you know, 
<sighs> who even knows where we're gonna be in a couple months or a couple weeks I mean everything seems to be changing so quickly but um, as of right now things in Florida are still on track um, John and I have our honeymoon planned for September for um, Disney World so we're keeping our fingers crossed that everything stays I guess how it is which I know in Florida isn't good right now uh I don't know I don't know I don't know what to do but if you've been down to any of the theme parks let me know how things have been for you um I'm definitely curious about people's experiences I have seen some friends go um but I always love to hear more experiences and how you guys are feeling about the theme parks and everything so I think that that's everything that I have for you guys so thank you so much for watching I really really appreciate it and I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys!